As they both bow down at roughly the same time. That's respect for one another. Colton Awaka down first though. Whole shoulder with the better angle on the charge, but Colton Awaka overpowering him, but he fell first onto the dirt before Whole shoulder fell out of the ring. And that is why it is called in his favor. But it looks like nice. Imp the Shimpan are getting up to call that mono E. Wow, that was a very fast mono E. It wasn't really a question of anything. I just wanted to make sure. Just double checking. Wait, what? Yeah. That's right. That is the correct call. That's right, that's right. <laughs> I'll show you looking down on Ichi Nojo. I'll show you can't get a grip on the belt, but now he's going for a pull around the arm. Ichi Nojo hopping forward, trying a slap, throw down, but it's not going to work. Double inside hole. I'll show you with the win. That's kind of what I said would happen. Ichi Nojo will turn up, but Ho Shoryu outclasses him. You can't call that a bad match from Snorlax. Ho Shoryu staring him down as they go down at roughly the same time. Ho Shoryu with a big charge, but Takeyasu eats it up and slaps him to the ground, showing him who's boss. With that, there are no undefeated left in this tournament, and that's just another man added to the three and one pile. Oh, Shoryu immediately getting a grip on the belt, trying for the throw. Oh, he trips from behind. They both fall on their back. I need to hear the Kimarite on that one. Kawazu Gake. Oshoryu getting slapped back at the Tachi Eye, all the way to the edge, gets behind Daisho, and that is all she wrote. Daisho turned around by Oshoryu's strong defense at the Tawara. Five and one, the front runner for this tournament. <laughs> You can hear a mouse fart. Going at it is whole Shoryu, but Wakamoto Haru oh, he gives up the double inside, a deadly move, but now he's trying to lift with the Morozashi grip. Nearly breaks the grip, but whole Shoryu with the double inside picks him up. Can't get the toss to the side, trips him from behind. Sotogake. Whole Shoryu, six and one. Oshoryu getting the catch inside right, outside left for both men right there. Soto Gake trip again, not gonna work. Trying to pull Tobizaru, not gonna work. Tobizaru trying to match, kicking the leg really hard. Now he's got the chest to chest, pushing forward. Oshoryu trying to throw Tobizaru, staying inside. Tobizaru getting pushed back with that hip forward. Belt pulled up, big throw, and wow, what a throw it was from Hole Shoryu. Really good sumo right there. Sadanoumi is down first, Hole Shoryu. Henka! Oh, there's going to be some unkind words for him. The crowd doesn't like it. They're they're not they're barely applauding for that one. <laughs> Big charge from Hoshori, but Shodai seems to wrangle him in. Not enough though. He steps out first as Hoshori charges through him at the edge. Hoshori with a nice quick win. Play spoiler. Enraged.
after losing his rank. Only Takeyumi just roll over and die like he has in the past couple of matches. Oshoryu gets the grip, outside left on the belt, pushing forward. Easiest Yorikiri of his life, no contest, and now he is the sole leader of first place. Oho on the left, Hoshoryu on the right. For first place in the Yusho race. Oho leans forward, gets the better of it initially, and slaps him down at the edge! Oh, Shoryu falls in such a simple manner. 10 and 2 for Oho, and the race is blown wide open. Oh, Shoryu getting slapped back, slaps to the side now. He's fighting back in the middle of the ring. Takakesho getting some good supati, but he gets pushed to the edge. Oh, Shoryu survives for just a moment longer, and he will take his second loss in a row. Takakesho, 10 and 3. Oh, Shoryu is losing it, and now Takeyasu is prime to be the man to take it all. They're both ready, setting each other down. Ooh, in the middle of the ring. Abhi's being pushed back, but falls! Oh, Shoryu down! Abhi takes it! What a slap down at the edge for Abi Hoshoryu. That's the second time he's lost to that technique in three days. Bam! Hoshoryu a little back from the line. Kiribayama right on top of it. Hoshoryu getting to the side. Locks in the outside right immediately. And Ho Kiribayama tries to throw it the inside. But Hoshoryu goes for it instead. Kiribayama survives it. Moves to the middle of the ring. Now he's trying to go chest to chest, but Hoshoryu locks in the inside left as well, loses the grip on the belt as Kiribayama breaks it, as they are still stalemated in the ring. Hoshoryu with the advantage, that outside right, giving him all the leverage he needs, pushing forward, Yori Kiri, 11 wins, and the Technique Award for Hoshoryu. That was a monstrous win for Hoshoryu, that was perfect! Yeah, really good to not falter at any moment against Kiribayama.